Right, breakfast, breakfast, mm, breakfast. Oh, good morning. Good morning, sir. Uh, I'm just perusing your fine menu. You don't, don't have much choice. Sadly, no. That's all we have currently. No, okay. Uh, I will have the eggs uh, scrambled uh, just with some olive oil. No salt, because I haven't got any. Uh, and an orange. That's, uh, that'll be good. Thank you very much. Very good. Hopefully it'll blow over. Very good. Thank you. Uh, the eggs aren't too scrambly. Okay, and the uh, other spoon for my orange? Yes, that's correct. Okay, oh. thanks very much. And if you need anything else, sir, I will be out here in the corridor admiring this magnificent carpet. Morning, howdy. Uh, I'm already thinking am I going to regret this. Uh, it's Saturday morning. I am later but it's because the weather is so dodgy. Uh, it's been forecast today and tomorrow to be essentially like this but very wet. Um, you can see by the ground it has been raining. Uh, I don't know if it was overnight. I think there's rain already. Um, yeah, this is the hotel grounds. Maybe we should do a little tour of the hotel. There's a swimming pool in there. The smallest swimming pool in the world. I'm in uh, building three, by the way. Three foot six inches. I think that's the length of it, <laughs> rather than the depth. Yeah, no diving, fat chance. Uh, yeah, so my plan is essentially to kind of stay closer to the hotel today just in case it, it probably will just kind of burst out into rain there's still loads of people milling around for a, a Saturday morning um, and still a lot of wonder of me talking to camera with people uh, looking at me but hey <laughs> so I got a plan was to again get the Collins Express from over there and go down to Fina um, it's 44th Street that I arrived at and was there the day before yesterday. Um, there is a golden sculpture there by Damien Hurst of a mammoth. It's called Gone But Not Forgotten. It's in a glass casing um, and it's, it's in the back of the FINA Hotel, kind of like the pool area. And I think what they've done is they've positioned it so that the public can see it uh, from the, the kind of beach walk at the back. So it's a bit of a kind of mini design area that you've got the FINA Bazaar and the FINA Forum buildings that I posted to Instagram uh, within the last day. You've got the FINA Hotel with the FINA Beach, but yeah, there's this Dome and Hearst. So I'm going to go down, well, I'm still thinking about it. I'm thinking, shall I just go back into the hotel? The thing is, I can't, I'm only here for a week. I've got to try, I've got my cap. Um, you know, there are other people out. I've not got a coat, but hey, really, you know, a coat is not gonna, it's not really gonna, stop me getting soaked if it comes to it I just have to hide you can see by the trees as to how stormy it is uh, or potentially it is so well, we're going to try and make something out of nothing today and tomorrow uh, Monday and Tuesday the weather should be generally back to normal 
um, which means I will be well I've got s several plans as to what I want to do um, for Monday and Tuesday but yes for now unless you see anything different in this video um, I am going to wait again for the Collins Express Collins Express has become my friend so we'll, let's go down to 44th Street the worst comes to the worst and it does piss down I can all right the thing is it's waiting around for a trolley to come back but the, the trolley stop is right by the hotel so it's not that I'm going to have to walk back to the hotel it's, it's just waiting around for a trolley but hey I'm English I shouldn't be used to this rain but I think this area it, it tends to be biblical so anyway let's let's give it a try don't get anything without trying this is how blustery it is I finally made it down to 44 but oh my god uh, this may this may be a brief brief video Jack there Jack Jack Black Jack just about in one piece just just about but uh, mad dogs and Englishmen they go out in the midday sun I think it goes but yeah we're gonna get down to it's around 36th Street for the FINA hotel <laughs> can't believe how blustery it is This is Gloucester. What number are we on here? They say we've got to get down to 36. It's only about like that on the map. I reckon it's about a quarter of an hour walk. Uh, I was here yesterday in better conditions. So did you know what? That does say stop. looking up to see like you know in Britain they've got the road names on the corners on the buildings they don't have anything like that here if it's not up above the road then there must be another way of knowing all right there's 40 second street is over there so we've got six streets to go just get blown down there people on the top, I was going to say there can't be that many people on the top yes there are and I've just missed another Lamborghini not caught it on the camera I think I may have got one, I've seen so many Lamborghinis around here as well as Lamborghinis and Ford Mustangs uh, and We're getting there. It is spotting with rain, but this is not a this is not a weather report video. Although I was determined to do something this weekend. Uh, the Fina Forum is just here, and the Fina Bazaar next to it. So we're kind of almost there. Where's a Lamborghini when you wanted to record your video? Hi. Hotel is here. 
Challenger. Loads of those as well. Loads of Dodge Challengers. Now, if this isn't a throughway, I'm going to go back. This is surely a walkway, a public walkway. We'll see to the beach. I think it must be. We're getting there. We're getting there. It's sad. I didn't want this weekend to be a complete write-off, so I'm going to force myself to go out. I'm not forcing myself, but you know the, the fact that it was, I think, 93% chance of rain, according to the BBC, uh, about half an hour ago. I'm not going to tempt fate, but yeah, once I've done this, I'll go back and then I think that's the, this is what I'm going to do today and tomorrow is like, it'll be little trips out and back to the hotel, out and back. Walk. May keep this running. This is Athena Hotel here, so we want to go right. We're looking for a mammoth, a golden mammoth. Hopefully we should be able to spot one and it's, it's still there and visible. Oh, look at the sea. Look how rough that is. Okay, we're on the beach walk. Maybe we're a little bit more covered here. I'm not going to speak too soon. Well, I don't know if I have or not. Looking for a golden mammoth. Talk amongst yourselves. I think it actually uses less battery by not turning it off and on all the time. I think we're in Mammoth Country. Some waves. Come on, Mammoth. Quote me happy. I think it's on this little junction here, if at all. It looks like a security guy here, so maybe. Oh, there's a gate, a wooden gate. Don't think you can see it. Oh, then we got one down. Oh, so, oh yeah, they have cleared it. Yeah. Or you can partially see it, they just need to cut some trees down, but you can see half, you see the back half, just need to take that umbrella down. Damien Hurst, the Golden Mammoth, I think that's probably the review. They've cleared that especially for the public. Yeah, I'm just going to ask the security guys if they can actually take down the umbrella and then you better see all of it. Anyway. Well, I've shame that. Well, I saw half of it. I may come back another time. I've got, uh, I've still got half left, half holiday left. It may be that that umbrella just needs to be put down, that red and white one there. Still won't see all of it, but because there's a palm tree in the way. God damn it! But anyway, uh, I saw a lifeguard tower. It's up there as a star. And there's a round one there. Boring. I've seen the round one. I've seen one before. It's not that one, but I like these. I may walk up here and get the star. Get the 
star and then uh, I think it's the Collins Express back to the hotel and then um, I'll start again. I've not lost my cat, I don't know why I put my hand to my head. I've not lost my cat, I'll take it off. Um, we've got a yellow and a purple flag, which basically means, what are you doing here? No, it means medium, medium hazard. and I'm getting off the beach. They haven't coordinated their flags because that one's got yellow and purple which means what are you doing? operation at 9 till 5. I think Paradise is closed today. Four buckets of spades. Local popsicles and coconut water. That reminds me, I'm going to go to CVS. There's one in there. There was one, it may have blown away. But I want to get some bits and pieces. We're nearly at the lime green one. Colours here on Miami Beach. 